In this video, we welcome you to enjoy the science of extreme with Servo World Class Lubricants. Servo was launched by Indian Oil in 1972, which brings you experience of over 50 years in R&D and marketing of World Class Lubricants. Servo is India's biggest lubricant brand. Let's now learn about the lubrication of turbines in power plants and the range of Servo Prime Series turbine oils. A power plant is a facility designed to produce electric energy from other forms of energy resources. Power plants that operate using steam, diesel, hydroelectric and nuclear power are conventional and power plants that operate using solar, wind, tidal and wave and geothermal energy are non-conventional. Electricity is produced via the rotation of a generator within a power plant. It operates using kinetic energy sourced from steam, gas, nuclear, tidal, hydroelectric etc. Let's see how electricity is generated in thermal power plants using steam turbines. The main operation of the thermal power plant begins when coal dust is sprayed into the combustion chamber and the air is supplied to the chamber through a forced draft. The ash is collected at the bottom and the carbon dioxide emission is sent out through a tower. A boiler with high pressure water is located in the combustion chamber. Due to the high temperature, the water in the boiler converts into steam and enters the turbine. Steam rotates the turbine which in turn rotates the coupled generator. Here, electricity is generated using the Fleming's right hand thumb rule and is supplied to the electrical power lines for transmission. After utilizing kinetic energy of steam, it is redirected to the boiler through the condenser. Hence, the process continues for generating large amounts of electricity. In this power plant, the turbine that operates is a turbo machine with at least one moving part called a rotor assembly, which is a shaft or drum with blades attached. Moving fluid acts on the blades so that they move and impart rotational energy to the rotor. Early turbine examples are windmills and water wheels. Let's look at the steam turbine's schematic representation. Turbine can be divided into three parts, that is high pressure turbine, intermediate pressure turbine and low pressure turbine. Let's understand the working of a steam turbine. The high pressure, high temperature steam from the boiler in the form of kinetic energy enters the steam turbine through the nozzle. This kinetic energy turns the airfoil shaped blades in the turbine. These blades are highly efficient. They enhance the flow of steam making its pressure and temperature drop at the outlet. The rotating shaft from the turbine is connected to the generator shaft and causes rotation in the generator. Having understood the role of turbines in power plants for generating electricity, now let us have a quick glance on how big a turbine is. It is also important to maintain these turbines in good condition. So, how can the efficiency of turbines be maintained and improved? One of the answers is proper lubrication. Lubrication is one of the crucial elements for smooth operation of turbines as it allows moving machine parts to slide smoothly past each other. The continuous rotation of the blades in the turbine and the generator induces large amount of heat. To protect the bearings in the turbine from being overheated, lubricant oil is applied to it. To meet the ever-increasing demands for electricity, Today's turbine systems are operating under increasingly severe conditions including wider temperature variances due to stop and start cyclic operation which has resulted in some instances of varnish formation on critical turbine component surfaces. 
temperature fluctuation in the turbine oil can result in oxidation and thermal degradation initially caused by elevated temperatures of the oil followed by the deposition of varnish on critical valves as the oil cools to lower temperatures. Resulting stuck valves can in turn cause unplanned downtime, added maintenance costs and lower productivity. By selecting the right lubricant, turbine operators can maximize production and profitability and reduce unscheduled downtime, which helps increase worker safety and meet challenging operating requirements. To select a well-balanced turbine lubricant, one should consider the following performance areas. Deposit control. To limit the generation of sludge and varnish while keeping deposits in suspension. Oxidation stability. Higher level oil-based stocks and advanced antioxidants. Air release and foam control. Excellent demulsibility. Filterability anti-rust and corrosion protection, wear protection, provide efficient cooling, longer service life to reduce maintenance. Now let's look at the turbine oils offered by Indian Oil Servo. Indian Oil Servo offers a range of turbine oils and these can be categorized into four segments. Servo Prime is the rust and oxidation type turbine oil that does not have any specific requirement of load. Servo Prime T is similar to Servo Prime oil but has anti wear properties. It is used in geared turbines. Servo Prime G and Prime LL are extreme pressure type turbine oils. They are used in geared and gas turbines to fulfill the demanding requirements. Servo Prime XL is the low varnish turbine oil suitable for turbines with bearing temperatures up to 250 degrees Celsius and has low sludge deposit forming tendency. Here is a glance of Servo Oil's unique performance. RPVOT stands for Rotating Pressurized Vessel Oxidation Test as per ASTM D2272. The test presents a simulated worst-case scenario where an oil sample is subjected to the harsh conditions of high temperature and high-pressure oxygen atmosphere in the presence of water and a copper catalyst. As oil oxidizes, oxygen is consumed and the pressure drops. Time taken in minutes to achieve a specific drop in pressure is then recorded. Oxidized turbine has the tendency to form varnish and sludge, resulting in costly and unexpected shutdowns. RPVOT value indicates the remaining oxidation test life of in-service turbine and other oils. Thus, higher RPVOT value signifies the longer remaining life of oil. This graph shows the RPVOT values of Servo Prime series and depicts that Servo Prime 32XL is having the highest RPVOT value of 1850 minutes in the turbine oil portfolio marketed by Indian Oil. Next is the Turbine Oil Oxidation Stability Test TOST. This is used to indicate the oil life for lubricants that are continuously exposed to gross water contamination, high temperature and air entrainment in field service. In this test, a mixture of oil and water is heated to 95 degrees Celsius in the presence of a catalyst and oxygen to simulate severe oxidation process. Here, the time required in hours is monitored for the increase in total acid number value of oil to 2.0 mg potassium hydroxide per gram. This graph shows the D943 TOST turbine oil oxidation stability test values for servo series. Our product Servo Prime 32LL is regarded as long life turbine oil as it has the TOST value greater than 10,000 hours. Servo Prime series has approvals from various OEMs like Siemens AG, MHI, General Electric, Bell and Alstom. Shown here is the comparison of performance and 
benefits of servo turbine oils. Let's summarize the key points. Indian oil in-house test protocols, strong technical knowledge and world-class R&D center which provides international standard turbine oils under Servo Prime and thereby helping the power industry and turbine OEMs to meet their stringent requirements for smooth operations of power plant turbines with high performance features such as long oil and filter life, long equipment life, turbine reliability. Indian oil with its robust turbine oil technology in combination with a good oil maintenance program Servo CMP helps their customers to achieve longer service and thus Servo Prime oils have numerous credentials for long oil running hours from esteemed customers like NTPC, IFCO, JSPL, JPL, NSPCL, RVUNL, CSPGCL and many more. The shown graph refers to the successful running hours of turbine oil at various industries ratified by our esteemed customers. Indian oil has got the most sought approval from international OEM. Mitsubishi Heavy Industries Limited MHI for its Servo Prime 32XL. Enjoy the science of extreme with Servo World Class Lubricants.